Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. I'm Paul Narotza. In this video today I'm going to show you the easiest way to troubleshoot the, the faulty RAM or the faulty RAM slot. So without further ado, let's get going. So over here as you can see I uh, have different types of motherboard. So just let's just this one here. As you can see, this is my RAM over here, this is my RAM stick, and this is my RAM slot, this is my RAM slot, so this motherboard has two RAM slots, as the other, this is the motherboard, as you can see over here, these are four RAM slots, so in my case, this RAM is well, and it's functioning very well, so the RAM is okay. Even the RAM slot, so the RAM slots are okay. So the other thing that you may I want to know when the RAM is faulty or the RAM slot is faulty, you may hear a beeping sound. So the beeping sound means that it's either there is a missing RAM, the other RAM is faulty, or RAM slot is faulty. That means that the computer didn't, so it hasn't picked the RAM. So this is my PC now, it's a, it has a missing RAM, so as you can hear, that beeping sound, that sound means that uh, there is a missing RAM, or in your case if you have a RAM, you have RAM sticks, and they are inserted in this RAM slot, so you say that the RAM slot is dead, or the RAM is dead, so troubleshoot that and check, use the, change the RAM slots, so you change the RAM stick, the, another RAM slot, or use another PC to do that. So that's the easiest way on how to troubleshoot and check if your RAM is dead or RAM slot. So it be here. Just have uh, two, sorry, three RAM sticks. So this one here, this is one GB. It's of DDR2. The other one here. Again, this is of uh, DDR2. And another one here. But this of uh, DDR3, so it's very easy to differentiate the types of RAM, and so you can use the there are very many ways to use in order to get the type of RAM. One, one, one way is that as I've used, as I've done it, manually opening the computer or the system unit to see the RAM. And sometimes you might find it uh, hard because some drum, drum sticks may not have been indicated. So in my case here, this is my RAM stick. As you can see, it's the only indicator the capacity which is of 1 GB, but no nowhere being indicated the type of DDR so there again this one 1 GB but no type of the DDR so that's now where you have to use some softwares so I'm uploading another video on how to differentiate the types of RAM so you can use other software there are very many softwares but I'll just major on the three softwares and uh, give them to you I'll give the I'll give you the download link so that you can again do it by yourself so this is the easiest way to check if your RAM or RAM slot is dead so when you start your PC then you hear that beeping sound you see this that's a beeping sound So just know that you say that your RAM is faulty, your RAM slot is faulty, or your computer is missing RAM. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and enable the bell and click the bell icon to enable notifications. Thanks for watching.